Hello and welcome to uh, this next new thing, uh, which is going to be a point and click adventure game by Wajitai Games. And we will soon get a title. Yeah, there we go. Emerald City Confidential. It is a game from 2009, and I'm getting some strange artifacts there with the mouse. Well, whatever. Things could have gone off to a better start, but hey. <laughs> so, um, this is uh, sort of a challenge I, challenge I uh, po put to myself here. I am actually going to play this game blind. That is, uh, I'm not going to use a walkthrough unless I absolutely have to. Which means I will miss some things, and um, yeah, you know, it's not gonna go very smoothly. <laughs> uh, but hey, um, figured I just can't go around playing with a walkthrough all the time. Uh, so, what is this game then? It is, I think, something that predates. Uh, the Blackwell Chronicles, although it has been uh, sort of refreshed for a uh, uh, release on Steam in 2009. Uh, you can see here that there are medals. Well, I doubt they were in the original release, uh, but I honestly don't know. Um, so, yeah, this is, of course being a Wajitai game, a game built using uh, the Adventure Game Studio toolset. Uh, I am actually kind of surprised at the resolution my uh, capture software is reporting here. It's uh, 720p at 50 hertz. I uh, wasn't expecting that. Um, also, <laughs> uh, yeah. As I said, I haven't played this game, so I don't know how the music is like, I don't know how the uh, sound is balanced, I... Well, I, I, I'm i pretty sure that uh, voice acting is really not a thing in this game. Uh, so, um, either I will read some of the stuff, not all of it, um, or, well, you'll just have to read it all yourself. <laughs> yeah, a lot of fun for you. Um, now, uh, actually, uh, before we get started on this, I uh, wanted to uh, say something else. I just started playing Shin Megami Tensei 4 on the uh, 3DS, and two hours in, I have not cleared the first tutorial dungeon. Yay me, I am so great <laughs> at playing video games. And, you know, exam coming up, and what the hell, now I'm playing in Multi Confidential. Keep your priorities straight, right? Uh, let's just look at the um, things here. Yeah, these are, I think, basically the uh, uh, default settings. I'm going to leave those alone. Um, if the sound is unbalanced in any way, well... Yeah. Oops. Ah, okay, yeah, there is... Yeah, okay, so there will be voice, apparently, but uh, not as much as in Black Wolf Chronicles. Or, well, Black Wolf Epiphany, at least. Uh, there's the option to mute sound. I am not going to use it. I don't know why the, why the mouse has this artifact thing or trail. That I, I don't think it's supposed to be there. Uh, now... I get this option to resume last game because I have actually started the game once before. I've done nothing else, just see if it starts at all. And I noticed that uh, if you try to start this with uh, two uh, separate displays, that is non-cloned, it's not gonna go well. So, uh, here I am with a cloned output, one on my screen, one on my capture device, and that is apparently just fine. So, hey, 
let's just uh, get started. See what's up with this game. Start a new game. This will overwrite your previous progress. Sure. That's what we want. The warehouse district. For months I've been following a trail of clues, and the trail ended here. That's right, Lion. I've almost got you. I've got a folder of documents that prove all of your crimes. I just need to get into that warehouse and see what you've been up to. Tutorial. Welcome to Emerald City Confidential. Click on objects to have Petra investigate them. You can't die or do anything wrong, so feel free to explore. <laughs> Phew. That's a lot of my chest. <laughs> uh, okay. So, about Lion. If on uh, well on the off chance that this is not common knowledge um, why would it be though um, this game is sort of set in a film noir rendition of the Wizard of Oz universe because why the hell not right <laughs> so lion is the lion from that movie or musical whatever and apparently the main character is named Petra. New quest. Get into the warehouse. Oh. A crowbar. I can let's look on a crowbar. Used by the law abiding to open crates? I'll just take it, you never know. <laughs> okay. So can I look at this in some way? Nope. Okay. <laughs> Hint, uh, you, you can uh, use the crowbar on uh, the door, apparently. Um, I want to poke the pot. Okay. Right, right, right. Crowbar on door. Uh, crowbar on Petra. <laughs> ah, you know, I just had to. Oh, well. Crowbar on door. Yes, right. please. Let's see what's in there. Hmm. Something tells me that what animation was not made by a woman. I did not see that one coming. I'm just feeling astonished myself. <laughs> okay, well, that's no, one way to wake up. You've been in worse scrapes. Let's see, what should I do? Uh, this is the dialogue panel. It lets you decide what Petra is going to say or do. Okay. So I can wriggle free, I can climb the rope or cut the rope. I think I'll try to climb the rope personally. No good. I'm not strong enough to pull myself up. Oh well. Maybe uh, wriggle free? Don't think Oh. I think I'm gonna call for help before I do anything drastic. I pride myself on being an independent gal, and I really hate to do this. But when push comes to shove, I don't want to die. Hello? Anybody out there? I could use a little help. Anyone? Help! So, you're awake at last. You're lucky I'm feeling generous, or I'd charge you for my time. Lion! Guilty as charged. Guilty is right! I've got enough evidence to put you away for life! Oh my, that is a problem. And I am good at solving problems. I wonder, how should I solve this one? Okay. Uh huh. I think Petra knows something I do not. <laughs> okay. 
Yeah, right, sure. What the hell? Let's roll with with this. <laughs> Someone will fall into something, but I don't think it will be me. Okay. I didn't do much good. What was in that warehouse? Warehouse? What warehouse? Don't play coy with me. You know what warehouse. Do you mean that warehouse that burned to the ground no less than 20 minutes ago? What? A freak accident. Quite sudden. I'm afraid that nobody will know what was in that warehouse now. Oh, let's see. Uh, do the number of keys work here? No. No number of keys in the dialogue tree. That is unfortunate. You call yourself a lawyer? No. I call myself the best lawyer. And I intend to stay that way. Enough talk. You wouldn't believe the amount of evidence I've got against you. You mean the evidence that was in your coat pocket? What? Hey, where did it go? Oh, uh... Oh, it's quite secure, I assure you. Crap. Anyway, I wish I could stay in chat, but I must be off. Do give my regards to the ground. Well... That is not what I was expecting at all. Oh, uh, well, okay, that takes care of that, I guess. Hey, watch it, lady, I'm flying here. Saved by the gum transit system. How embarrassing. Yeah, sorry, you available? Yeah, the meat is running. Where do you want to go? Just take me home, Plumley Street. All right, hold on. Huh. Gump. Would that be a reference to Forrest Gump, you think? There was a... Tax... I think there was a taxi involved somewhere in that movie. Lion. That's the fifth time he's nearly killed me. I'll get him one day. Who am I kidding? Do the bad guys ever get punished these days? I even lost my journal chasing that lion around the city. How can I be a detective without a proper journal? Hmm, that reminds me. I think I have a spare journal in my file cabinet. I should take a look and see. Ah. Uh -huh. Hint, we have a filing cabinet. I'm guessing it's this one. <laughs> Could be. Huh. So if uh, we've been nearly killed five times, why do we, like, persist? Seriously. Okay. Huh? <laughs> Simpler times. Yeah. I think I can sympathize with that. Let's see. No time for sitting around. Okay. Uh, I want to click myself. I am not allowed to click myself. I'm just going to go open the file cabinet now. 
just take a look. If I uncover anything interesting or worthwhile, I'll write it down. It saves me from needing to remember every word people say. Good thing I have a spare. I always feel lost without my journal. You hear that, Emerald City? I'm packing a new notebook and I'm not afraid to use it. Go, girl. A knock. Hey, Lion, if that's you, I suggest you beat it. I beg your pardon. Uh, never mind. I'll be right there. Come on in. Thank you. You're Petra. Oh boy. That's what it says on the door. What can I do for you, Miss D? You can call me D. All right, D. What brings you downtown? I'm looking for someone. His name is Ansel, my fiance. Ansel, huh? And how long's he been missing? I haven't seen him for several months. He likes to travel. Go on. Well, I heard that he got back two nights ago, but I haven't seen him. Nobody has seen him. He just vanished. So, who told you he was back? Nobody. I have a magic device that keeps tabs on him. A magic device? Those are illegal. I have a magic license. I'm not breaking any law. What did this magical device say? He was visiting Gillikin country before entering the city. Aside from that, nothing. I have to know what happened to him. Can you help me? A missing fiance? Sounds like a case of cold feet to me. Still, a case is a case. Next month's rent is due soon, and I could use the emeralds. I'll give you an advance of 200 emeralds. 500 more when you find him. 700 emeralds? Scratch next month's rent. That would cover me till summer. Looks like you got yourself a detective, Dee. I knew you were the right woman for the job. Here's a picture of him. Where can I contact you if I find anything? Oh, I'll contact you. I'll be watching. If I need to speak to you, you'll hear from me. Great. I not only have a client, but a guardian angel, too. What's her hmm. angle? The warning signs whirl around me like a tornado, but the money is too good to pass up. Wait a minute. Tornado? I wonder... Oh, no. D. Gale. Uh, you mean my mo? Excuse me, Miss Gale. Yes. Uh huh. Oh, very clever. You might just solve this after all. I knew it. Dorothy Gale, the bright-eyed little girl who flew her way into Oz over 40 years ago. What is she doing here? Isn't she an honorary princess? Why does she need my help when she could just ask Queen Ozma to wave her magic wand? Still, I can't argue with a princess, and I certainly can't argue huh. with the 200 emeralds in my purse. I guess I'd better get going. Ansel was in Gillikin country. That means he came through the North Gate. That's probably where I should start. That was Dorothy. Huh. Well, well. And apparently we go to North Gate. And yeah, let's look at that journal. I was kind of expecting to uh, have to write stuff down. But pills. Okay. Aha, uh -huh, so there you go. We have an in game hint system. <laughs> ah. Oh. Okay. Uh, oops. I guess I should. <laughs> Mm, shouldn't have done that. <clears throat> uh, moving on.
Petra can fly around the city using the Gump taxi service. Click on the Gump stand to travel to a new location. Let's have a look around though. Go to scraps. Nope. Columbia Street. Okay. I don't know if you noticed, but the uh, character uh, sprites or whatever they are were kind of transparent, actually. That's a bit weird. Uh huh. So that's how the map works. We are going to the north gate. See, I don't know if you can. S I don't think you can, but there's kind of a hint of the contour running through here, just right through Petra. You can sort of see it through her skirt, which is a very weird thing to say. I just realized. Never mind. Let's uh, speak to the guy. Of all the soldiers to Glory. be on duty. Charming as ever. I have some questions for you. That is your privilege. I'm looking for a man named Ansel. He was last reported coming through this gate two nights ago. You are mistaken. No one named Ansel came through this gate two nights ago or ever. You're sure? Affirmative. My memory is infallible. Were you on duty two nights ago? Negative. I was on duty in the palace. Then how do you know for certain who came through the gate? I have memorized the records. Nobody named Ansel came through here. Could he have used a false name? Using a false name is a felony. But could he have done it? It is within the parameters of possibility. How can we find out for sure? If you have a photograph of the man, I can cross-reference him with the name he gave. Woohoo! I actually succeeded at something. This is a photograph of Ansel. Do you recognize him? Affirmative. He did not use the name Ansel when he entered the city. He will have to report back to me and tell the truth in order to avoid prosecution. Maybe I can tell him for you. What was his destination? His destination was registered as 43 Granetta Lane, Emerald City. The residence of Miss Betsy Bobbins. Thanks a mil, TikTok. Only doing my duty. Betsy Bobbins. Sure. Procedure book? Huh? Okay. Kill okay, up in the woods. Winky's up there. Hmm. Oh, okay. Sure. Hey, what? what? Ah, so pause brings up this. Okay. Okay, okay. Uh, we are good, I think. Uh... Petra's office over there, or Granata's Lane. That should probably be Granata probably be our next protocol. The streets in the Emerald City. At least they clean it once in a while, which is more than you can say from my neighborhood. Uh, a horse named Hank. Why not? This is a point-and-click adventure game. I'll let it roll. Okay. Have some questions for him. you got questions you ask me nobody gets in to see the missus without my say so who is she if you don't know then why are you bugging Ooh, her name came up spelling. In an investigation i'm working on investigation what does the guard want with betsy 
I'm not with the guard. I'm freelance. Look, Betsy don't get mixed up with stuff like that. So you say. I have to find out for myself. I need to get inside. Well done. I only let Betsy's boyfriends get past this door. Well, them and deliveries. Deliveries? Then send her presents. Flowers, jewelry, clothes, what have you. She doesn't always take them in. But she takes the presents. <laughs> Oh boy. That's how we're gonna do things. Okay. I will endeavor to find some flowers, and uh, I think I will save that for um, next episode. This has been uh, my first time with um, Emerald City Confidential, a seven year old game. And uh, I'm uh, slightly confused, which is perfectly fine uh, for an adventure game. Um, I think I'll actually increase the game volume a little. Uh, so yeah, I will see you in the next episode.